In this video, I'm going to show a voltage test on these Ion Sync Earthing Plug grounded tabby shoes. And as you can see, it has four conductive contact points at the mid of the foot. And on this shoe, I'm wearing no sock, while on the other shoe, I'm wearing a toe sock. So to take this reading, I have a voltmeter that has one lead measuring the ground. So it's plugged into the ground right there. And then the other lead, I'm gonna hook up to a conductive brace that I'm wearing, which is gonna measure the voltage of my body. And then this extension cord right here is plugged into the wall. So this is gonna simulate a 60 Hertz EMF field on my body, which is gonna raise my voltage up to, let's say, between like three and six volts, as you can see on the voltmeter there. And I'm sitting on a insulated platform. I got a car tire under me and then a big wood block under my feet. So I'm insulated at the moment. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna step down with the tabby shoe that's wearing no sock and put my body weight on that while still holding the uh, extension cord on my lap. And as you can see, the voltage drop. Now I'm gonna step back up. You see the voltage go back up. And now I'm gonna step down with the shoe wearing the sock. So step down with my body weight, contacting the ground, measuring my voltage with the uh, extension cord still sitting on my lap. And then step back up, voltage goes back up. And now I'm gonna step down with both feet, which is probably gonna allow for the best reading because both feet will be grounded, more contact surface area between me and the earth. So there you see both feet, body weight, still holding the extension cord, measuring my voltage potential between me and the ground. Step back up, voltage goes back up. And so there you can see these sports jog tabby shoes with the ion sink earthing plugs grounded through the midsole and how they're able to ground the body through those contact points, which you can find now available at earthrunners.com.